Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we have an exciting unboxing and review for you. We will be diving into the Sega Dexos X18 16TB Enterprise Edition hard drive, one of the most popular choice for Enterprise Stores solution. Let's unbox it first. <music> Look at that, it's a solid, robust piece of hardware. The Sega Dexos X18 offers up to 270MB per second sustained transfer rates, which is impressive for a hard drive of this capacity. 0.35% failure rating, and especially the 5-year warranty with 550TB workload specification. This is insane. It also comes with Sega Advanced right caching technology to help improve performance. In real life computer usage, I get around 200 megabyte per second write speed, which is more than enough for data hoarding. I'm not gonna use it as a primary hard drive, meaning I will only, and only use this to store my data. I copy my project files to my NVMe SSD from this hard drive cause SSD has unbelievably blazing speed more than 6 GB per second compared to 200 MB per second. I checked I can still edit from this hard drive without any problem. But if my project is huge, I usually copy my files to my SSD and edit from there because I don't want to lose any frame. The Exos X18 features a 72,000 RPM spinning speed, making it ideal for high performance data center hard drive is designed to handle intensive workloads and provides a massive 16 terabyte of storage capacity but in real life it's not 16 it's about 14 terabyte because they calculate 100 gigabyte as one terabyte the design is pretty standard for an enterprise hard drive it has a SATA 6 gigabyte per second inter interface which is pretty common and ensures compatibility with a wide range of systems such as pc or nas the annual maximum workload data is 550 terabyte, which is promising the highest compared to any other model and brands in the market right now. I personally not gonna read and write 550 terabyte of storage per year for sure, but data centers can do those things. Now let's plug it in and run some tests to see how it performs. I'll be using it in my computers right now and maybe in my NAS in future. So you can use it any device, either your computer or NAS. This is mainly designed for data center hard drive or meaning you can use it 24 seven without even shutting it down. If you take a look at this picture, you will clearly see why this enterprise series is the best. Tech giant like Google, Facebook, they use this kind of enterprise series hard drive in their data center. When the drive is failing, they just replace it with a new one. This is one of the reason, reasons I want it in my system. I also used Seagate other models such as IronWolf, IronWolf Pro, Barracuda, etc. They all performed well and only one of them had a bad sector after three years of usage. But I never lost any data from them. Here is this, here in this photo, you can clearly see this Seagate Enterprise series has the best quality in terms of values and features and most likely longevity that 
we all need. It provides 5 years replacement warranty, what many of you might claim. Especially people like me who hoards a lot of data from their different cameras. So it also provides data rescue service if you have warranty. The read and write speed are excellent for a 7200 RPM hard drive. This makes it a great option for data heavy applications like big data analytics, analytics, cloud storage, and even as a high capacity backup solution. Probably the most desired even in 2024 right now. NVMe SSDs are still expensive compared to spinning hard drives, but for storage or archiving purpose for huge amount of data is still an economical way. In terms of noise and vibration, the Exos X18 performs admirably. It's quieter than you might expect for enterprise hard drive and vibration level is minimal, which is crucial for maintaining data integrity in multi-drive environments. So, there you have it. The Seagate Exos X18 16TB hard drive is a powerhouse of storage offering high capacity, excellent performance and reliability which make it a top choice for enterprise users and anyone with significant storage needs. I've been using it for the last two months without any issue, but sometimes it's louder, which may not be ideal for studio atmosphere. Otherwise, everything is okay. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe.